Also in Hamilton, the pro-Palestinian encampment at McMaster University is now in its third week. And today, students were joined by faculty in a show of solidarity during ongoing negotiations with the university. Maria Saru joining us live now from McMaster University. Maria, how are negotiations going between the protesters and school leaders? Matt, right now the protesters negotiating team is meeting with a group of university administra administration. The school has confirmed the dean is at the table, but won't clarify whether the president is also attending. Um, Students say they've been told by the university an offer is coming soon. Whether it'll be today is still unclear, but they're hoping to hear back about a proposal they say they presented to the dean last night. Protesters are staying tight-lipped about the details of that proposal, but signaled earlier they won't leave until the university meets all their demands. The question here is why is the dean of student affairs the one to be talking about an offer that is ultimately about the university's investments? We're looking for a written agreement from the university to meet our demands, our four demands, the disclose, divest, boycott and declare. The policy of the camp is that we're going to stay here uh, until we're satisfied with the offer. As for the offer, it needs to be uh, firm and clear that we're standing against the ongoing genocide. Hamilton police said today they continue to be updated by McMaster but have not been called to assist. It's Faculty Solidarity Day here at the encampment and there's more programming to come. But for now, Matt, it's back to you.